Hello, my name is Findimus, and in this video we are going to be learning about placeholder text to a text field. If you want to follow along, the link is in the description down below. Let's begin. Placeholder text is what is displayed in your input element before your user has inputted anything. You can create placeholder text like so. Input type equals text in quotations. Placeholder equals this is placeholder text in quotes. Right? Remember that input elements are self-closing. I believe this is about the third self-closing element we've seen. And if you look over here on the side, you can kind of see um, image is self-closing. Input self-closing. I don't remember the other one right now. Okay. So the objective for this challenge is, well, first we'll read this. Set the placeholder value of your text input to cat photo URL. So here we have the input type, but we need placeholder text. So we need a space here, and you type place holder equals cat photo URL. Then we'll go down to the objectives and just read them to make sure we pass this challenge test. You should add placeholder attribute to the existing input element. So here's the placeholder attribute, here's a type attribute, and then here's the element, its input. You should set the value of your placeholder attribute to cat photo URL, and that was done. The finished input element should not have a closing tag. Um, what they're referring to is that they don't want you typing forward slash input because I guess that would maybe mess it up. I'm not positive. I'm not sure exactly. The finished input element should have valid syntax. I'm not positive. I know syntax is kind of the way that you put your code in, and I guess not having a closing tag would make it valid. I'm not positive there. But here, you can kind of input whatever you want. It's kind of nice. And so we'll run the test for this challenge. Thundercuts. Oh, good job, everybody. Make sure you submit and go to the next challenge or, you know, have a great day if you're done coding for the day. I'll take us to the outro. Thank you for watching. If you feel this video was helpful or you liked it, then click the like button. If you want to see more content like this, then subscribe. And if you have any questions, post them in the comments down below. I am Finnemis, and I will see you later. Have a good day, everybody.